Like, there's a tournament, like, every weekend, it feels like. And that, I mean, that's that's awesome, honestly, yeah. because, like, again, here in, uh, like, like more Central Florida, Central Florida, North Florida, uh, slash Tampa, it always seems as if we have, like, a big tournament at least once every two weeks. Yeah. And sometimes you get big events in the same weekend. Today we have a North Florida Regional, and tomorrow we have a, a Central Florida Regional. Yeah. Like, that's it's nuts. crazy. But here we go. Epic underscore Gabriel versus Tachyon on the board, ladies and gentlemen. This is for a spot in top eight winners. Yeah. It's going to be an interesting matchup. Uh, I don't, like I said, I don't know how many how much they've played, so I'm not really sure how much uh, experience Tachyon will have with Rob. But I do know Epic Gabriel is going to have a decent amount of experience. Oh, my gosh. Him. Literally the best Pikachu practice on Earth. Yeah. East Sam, ladies and gentlemen, recently moving to Central Florida and has been grinding out our players for the past two weeks, really conditioning us for this matchup, essentially. Yeah. It's so, be interesting. Uh, again, this is, uh, this is essentially our first battle against a, uh, against a Pikachu other than East Sam in the past two weeks. Of course, we do have, you know, other Pikachu mains in our region. We sure do. But this is, uh, EZM's just all over the level, man. Yeah, it's crazy. You can tell, like, how much time EZM puts into the character. It's like, I don't know if I could do that. Tachyon and Ridier, though, the two players yeah. from around Florida making big moves with the Rats as of recent. Right. And currently, Tachyon really putting in the work against Gabriel at the moment. Yeah, putting just, him against finds a kill, really. Whoa. 132, he's going to make it back Beautiful with that up to avoid the, the side B there. I was a little bit concerned that he might not be able to make it back from there, but he did. That's uh -oh. so scary, trying to get up through the gyro, but shielding all of side B, and now just needs to find the kill. Fair, not quite going to do it. Just can't quite edge card Rob oh the same my. way you can other oh characters. My. Oh no, Does the last hit is there, doesn't no. hit. He just must can't be. take him out right now. <laughs> Down air, spiking against the stage, the F smash just to try to finish it off. But Tachyon honestly doesn't need a move like that. He just pull off a fair like that. Yeah, that was a really nice fair. And now Jack's kind of starting to get behind uh, Tachyon here. And that's the thing. Uh, this is the first time we've had a regional like in Jacks in a while, like uh, we've said a few times. And so this will be the first time Tachyon's been like in his homeland. You know. Tachyon. Now at even stock with Epic Gabriel. Epic Gabriel on the offensive now, still pressuring with the gyro. This is this is only game one. It just feels as if these two players have been feeling each other out for like the past like five minutes. Yeah, I mean and it, they oh kinda my. have. Oh my! Whoa, that could have been really bad for Tachyon. Like huh. what a reversal that would have been. First of all, Gabriel surviving that. Second of all, yeah. Tachyon teching that. Well, but that's it, of course. Beat. Spin to win. Well, that's what I got what I was saying about uh, Rob. Like, you just can't really edge oh, the same way you can edge characters. God. But Tachyon doesn't care, and that forward air evens things up here. The last stock situation, and he still has the gyro. Back air. Oh my god. Another one there. Oh, that's scary. Oh, Good thunder, that's great. Though. Great from Tachyon. Just has to be aware of the Rob working. down air. I love that T Jolt. So t it feels like it. This feels like Game Five for some reason. The way that it's like so tense and the way they're like so so close and back and forth right now. Nice back air there too. It's like footsies at this point, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> they they like they want to attack each other, but like barely. You know right. what I mean? And they're both like, definitely capable of like playing this safe, you know. Oh my god. Oh my god. Attack on no. Just about missing it. He escapes. Gabriel. Now on the offensive, gets the grab. Ooh, the mash from Tachyon right before Gabriel was oh, getting about to get that down throw. Tachyon. Still surviving somehow. Recovering with fair, covering the ledge. Nice, well, Gabriel reading that. I like how he waited out the down air too. Oh, oh that's, that's gonna it. be it. Up smash, scooping him up. 
and sending him to game two. That was that was sick. I'm a fan. Yo, came on with the bottle flip. That was nuts. Um, yeah, no, that was like weirdly slow in that like that took like maybe four minutes or something. I mean, that it was just so back and forth and very. It slow. felt like it was forever. Purely because, again, like sometimes game ones are legitimately used yeah. purely for conditioning reasons. Three, you know what I mean? Two, one, go. Uh, yeah, no, I mean that's kind of what it looks like, especially like the first, like, I don't know, three minutes of that game. We're just kind of like very, very safe, like footsies, you know, like you said. And we didn't actually see like anything like too advanced from each player either. We didn't right. see like any of the cool fair, uh, cool gyro fair combos from from Gabriel or anything of the sort. He didn't even overextend off stage or anything like that. Even Tachyon was being, you know, super, super neutral when it yeah. came to, you know, covering Gabriel off stage. It was really just, you know, safer, safer options. Can you make it back? Oh. Yeah. Oh, Gabriel, got to make it back. Yeah, he's got to wait for him. That's like watching a cutscene. You're just like, well, all right. No. Uh, yeah, might I'll, as well I'll just, just I'll just wait for a second. Up You're just like mashing start. Yeah. <laughs> like please. To get it over with. Yeah. But know, Gabriel Gabriel's looking absolutely. good, man. Oh no, absolutely. I mean, in comparison to what was last game, where again it was just really just a mix of, I guess just back and forth, a mix of just yeah. conditioning. To now, like Gabriel's actually just seriously on the front end, yeah. not letting Tachyon get in. I wonder if this is like just not a great matchup for Pikachu. I don't really like. I think it's a fine matchup. It's for hard Pikachu, to honestly. say that it's like not good, but it's just like the way that Gabriel's sort of commanding things right now it makes it, it makes it look kind of rough. But if, it's, I'm, if I'm not mistaken, Gabriel even like considered this matchup bad for Rob at some point. I I believe that he he literally released like a like a matchup chart like a like a week or two ago. Oh yeah, that's right. I don't remember where Pikachu was, but I think he was like oh, at that losing problem. But Tachyon! Finally taking the stock. Oh, oh that's gonna take the stock too. Yeah. Tachyon down one. Good coverage. Couldn't extend the combo though, and Gabriel. A uh, hard read in a sense, just immediately yeah. getting that air dodge. Oh, Tachyon going so low in there! That was scary. He tried to go for the thunder too, which I, I really respect actually. He's sort of going for the, the double dip, if you will. Oh, great use of Lovely up tilt conversion. by Tachyon. Yeah, his conversions are really good. He just needs to start, I think he just needs to be a little bit more consistent with them. I feel like he hasn't really been able to land uh, that much, that many of them. Oh, just, whoa, that's scary. That's still very scary. Just about to get back up. Getting wow. caught out by side B. I can't believe that caught, too. I know. Rob is wacky. And now Tachyon's turn to go under the stage, but it's not going to pay off in the same way. The side B will take game two for Epic Gabriel. Yeah, this seems to be like just cut and dry. I mean, Tachyon, he's had his opportunities off stage. And I mean, that's why you see me getting, you know, so nervous on the mic because I seriously think that, you know, Tachyon. Off of any one of those like single fares, like super deep off stage, because Gabriel does have a tendency to just straggle along the outside. Yeah. A single one of those hits from the fares will do it for him. But somehow Gabriel's movement or Gabriel's drift off stage somehow always evades it. Yeah, and it's interesting that they're, they're sticking with the Smashville pick. Honestly, I, I just I don't know if there's something that uh. Tachyon would prefer, but like, I don't know. I just feel like the stage hasn't been doing him too many favors. I don't know. We'll see how we can utilize it here. Starting the back air train, but only landing the one. Maybe waiting for an air dodge there or something. I really don't know. Oh. On the up smash, though, an early kill for uh, Epic Gabriel. And it looks like he might just be running away with this set. Oh, again, covered from Tachyon. 
Yeah, it just really doesn't feel like Tachyon's like able to to get started here. Like just oh! not the conversions the way he needs to, and that that back air. Oh, a nice stuff from Tachyon. Beautiful answer after Gabriel puts him against the ropes. Yeah, and he needed that. I feel like he really needed the, the momentum from that. And now he can start something here. Uh oh, the Good loops. Conversion. Brother, give me loops. Still and even answer with it the going. down air. Nearly catching him out with a thunder, too. We're hearing Jax getting behind uh, Tachyon now. Just trying to give him that extra bit of motivation. Ooh. There's that comeback. Tachyon was down by so much. And somehow he's back. Oh my god. To trying guard. to connect with the downer. Anything of the sort. Just trying to set up Gabriel for something. But just couldn't connect. He's looking pretty good now. Like I, I feel like he's got Gabriel a little bit shook. Oh. Oh, getting reflected. Wait, the back air? Good tech though. Right. Extra damage, if nothing else. Now it just needs to find his kill. Oh, Tachyon. Scary landing. Uh, just keeping his distance at the moment, not allowing it to happen. Finally, the dash attack hits. That takes it's Tachyon. The lead. Takes his first lead, essentially, yeah, of this set. See if he can hold on to it. Not at all. He gets side beat again. And that's like. Fifth one, I think we've seen like Gabriel's been landing so many of them. Yeah, somehow an equalizer every single time. Yeah. And now Gabriel trying to close this one out. A perfect 3 0 to make his way into top eight winners. Or it could be Tachyon yeah. representing Northern Florida. Well, and beautiful winners, air dodge. Can Tachyon? Guard? No. Oh, so needs to make close. it back. Uh, side B not going to kill, but it's super close to it. Gabriel's trying to line up that downer. It doesn't happen. Nair in response from Tachyon, and he's back in neutral. Oh no, that laser. Oh no. He's back. Back. Uh, no, that's, that's not going to kill yeah, either. Yeah, Tachyon's back. Can he, can he make this back, though, this comeback? I it's looking really scary for him. I don't know. Landing on him with the Nair and an up smash from Epic Gabriel does take the set. 3-0 in the end. Tachyon looked better in that game, but it just wasn't enough, I don't think. Yeah, no, absolutely. I mean, Gabriel just seemed like the better player that entire time, or at least, you know, better in terms of the matchup that yeah. entire time. He, seemed, he just seemed more equipped, I think, just to deal with uh, 